Hello. Rats, 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 rats. Yeah, oh boy, yeah. I was just talking to the lads actually, saying saying pretty much the same thing. I'm. The more I thought about, it, the more I was disappointed with this last time, and I I hope that there's rapid improvement. I really do. I think it had a surprisingly disappointing start, which was a bit of a shame. Kitties tomorrow. Kitties tomorrow. I should, with any luck, I should be home by midday. And then I'll, uh, there'll be kitty kitty cats. Obviously, I don't know if I'll be streaming tomorrow. Uh, frankly, <laughs> I don't know how it will go. I. If they are sleepy and want to be left by themselves, then I will I will do something that I can stop at a moment's notice kind of stream. Hey Colin, not too bad. Mate, how are you? I'll need to try and work out a cat cam or something, I don't know. I'll have, I'll have a consent. I spent a fair whack of today, like... <sighs> preparing, <sighs> excuse me, preparing stuff and getting things ready. I actually have a side on my PC again. I had to, uh, I made, I bought some mesh. I bought some mesh and like some magnets, so I can magnetize the, uh, like the mesh, and sort of stick it against the side. So it basically provides a solid like air. Air can get out and heat can get out, but uh, kitty cats and cat <laughs> hair cannot get in. <laughs> Because I don't tend to run the side on my PC cases normally, but... Nomad Sky, what, what a turnaround that little game was. Oh, Jag, you hit the nice jackpot, mate. Nice. Thank you very much, man. That's a long fucking time, though, jokes aside. Appreciate it, dude. Seriously. I mean, obviously, that's like, you know, that's it now. 69. I kind of ruined it, but I kept streaming afterwards, really, didn't I? No one. Uh, there's, there is excitement for being Cat Dad, and definite panic for being Cat Dad. It's, it's a bit of both. I hope I've got everything ready. The most confusing thing is working out how much, like, wet food to feed them. I've seen different answers of, like, some things, like, some feedings suggest that you can never overfeed a kitten, just if they want to eat, like, put it down, and if they eat it, good, if they don't, then, you know, feed them slightly less. So I'm not quite sure at the moment. Have I moved anything bappable off the shelves? Nope. Nope, I have not. They're not coming in here initially, <laughs> and he's not without me. Lude. So I'll keep an eye on them. Um, but I'm gonna, there's, there is gonna, gonna be some, there is gonna be some smashing, there's not a lot I can do about it. I got lots of weeb shit and figurines and things. I'll move some of them to like the glass IKEA cabinet that are a bit more fragile than others, I think. But it is what it is, though. Hey, very. Right. Thank you again for the reset, man. And thank you very much for the gift again. Will there be a cat cam? I'll, I'll try and get something sorted, yeah. I'll try and get something sorted. Where do we park our two little nerds, anyway? It was after. It was, it was raining and we're in the. Did that work? We're in the city, wasn't it? There actually was a temporary med cam. Very made one. There was a hamster cam. It linked to my phone, and I did, I did, I did do it a few times. Oh yes, we were in Slopsville, weren't we? They didn't let go easily. Hey, what are you doing here? We. Oops. Oh, I used a controller last time, didn't I? I just realised that's why I'm not feeling very familiar with the mouse controls. Meg was a good bean. Hey, Nat. Just 
crossing. No one gets out. Those are the orders. Wait, no. You should be dead. He's going to throw. Amicia. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Lord. That was so close. So why have we got the flashing red thing? Kill the soldier of the army of Provence. I know. Why did he attack us? Yeah, it definitely was difficult to work, wasn't it, right? Like, I remember you had a lot of trouble with it. Look. They're killing townsfolk. They're, ah. they're purging the districts now. She looks fine. Hey, come back here, you bastard! Oh. What's that? Listen. You can use that sword to trick it. Take this to Grafsman Extinguis. It should be enough to put out that torch. It's time for us to find out. I can now extinguish us. Bonk! Ow! I feel he's close enough those rats should eat him. Where did they come from? I will craft extinguishers. Good gracious! We did it in the past, but disturbing yes I may have to use it I have to use my powers for evil thanks what a shame he was a good man what a wrong way to die are they busy eating man I can just go past them Pardon me, rats. Did you just run through the rats? Don't think I didn't see that. Just stay there, all right? Get down, another one. Shit. I cannot meet to open them doors. I know what's in there. The rats are close. Shut up. That's your problem. Whoever gets out gets killed. Is it me or does he seem really casual around the rats? Like the first, the that's this is a this is the one thing that's been weirding me out a little bit. Like in the first game, the rats were like incredibly like terrifying to everybody. Like even with people with torches, were freaking the fuck out. This goes like, yeah, it's just you know I've seen the odd rat rat apocalypse now and again. This is like my third rat apocalypse, honestly. Like you know. Hey, thank you, cleverly blonde. Thank you very much. Forty is a big one as well. Thank you so so much. So, can we put his thing out? Lolly. Yeah, fuck him. Hey, thanks, Cube. How was your stream? Lolly. Ratties. Could go that way. We must leave the city. Leave this bomb down behind. For what, Amicia? A dream of an island. But the dream he's been having for weeks. We already know he's like psychic rat boy. So I imagine that dream's kind of story. Elgid. Oh, I thought that was good news. Oh, she's probably fine. Crypt Master. Remember to mark the houses you clean with a cross. What's Crypt Master? It's imperative that the body. How are you finding your skull, son? It looks quite good. Sure, take the bodies out. The rats will follow. How can they be so stupid? Yeah, it looks alright, actually. Rat Jesus. I love Rat Jesus. I feel that using the pot here is the right solution, but it didn't work. Strange. 
I could put this thing out, but Go find another dinner, I guess we want to make more, more, more gribbler. So we put this out first. Then he's like, "Nani?" That sound. What's that mean? No, lock onto that. Sorted. Did that work? Hmm. I feel they were cl too close to light there, but I mean. I guess if this guy comes down here, we can then bin him here, and that's a bit easier. Fix that problem. Alright, let's try again. We must leave the city. Keep this bomb down behind. For what, Amicia? We're truly not an island. For ratties. I think that was the solution we were supposed to do that. But. They literally just walk through the rats. Don't tell me they're also punching me out, Scott. Oh, God damn it! Hey, hey, we can still reach him before then. Never rats. Like I said, they're all too casual about the whole rat thing now, which is really weirding me out. So we need to get a. Cr is there a stick here? There are lots of sticks here, but there are no sticks I'm allowed to use. This is keeps doing my fucking Sweden. Why can we not use the wood that's next to us? I know it's like video game, dodge pick, but like, it's- Stop putting wood next to the things I'm not allowed to use wood with, then. It looks very dopey. Oh, I don't have any pots. Okay. I thought I did. Is there anything here that I can use, then? Ah. What do we have here? A tool. I could improve my gear if I found a workbench. Nice. Any news from the gallant soldiers? Nah. I already gave the beast full power over the city. The beast? That explains the carnage. The man's a dog of war. You're noble. We only need choice wood. Yeah, we only get special wood. Already. Extinguishing pot. Something behind. Good luck with that. <laughs> they wasted enough of our time already. Come. They yeah, fuck them. There must be a way to open. I'm not familiar with the first game of this. No, I mean to be fair, that these are definitely evil rats. I'll, gi I'll give them the break that these are these are evil sussy rats, but still. I hope Hugo's holding on. I hate to say it, but he's survived worse. This has to stop. Our our brother our brother is the rat king. He gets the rat max. Oh, do I need to tell him to do the thing, or will he stand here like a lemon? No, good. Okay. Uh, we're going to have a problem. What? Uh, there's no break on this thing, so we'll have to run. Where's it opening? Beneath us, I guess. That's it. Release on my go. Now, go. Coming. Whee! Come on! Faster! I'm right behind you! Ooh. Yes! We're here! Good work! Nice weather! Look! No rats! So they stopped at the city. Rats are super friendly, IRL, normally. Especially, like, nice rats. Fancy rats. I not see any soldiers either. Yeah, but. I've just remembered. In Bodan's laboratory, th there was a fresco with an island on it. I saw it, Lucas. What about that? 
Bodal must know about it. All right, all right. I feel we should get a fucking mosey on before the ratters come to get us. Thank you. Now, Mother said the herbalist lives at the edge of a forest. We should be close. It's so quiet. It feels off. There were people here not too long ago. No blood. No sign of a fight. Someone used that forge recently. Hey, there's a workbench here. Oh, you nice. Can gear with it. I can improve my gear with Take it. A look right now. We don't know what awaits us. I love right. workbenches. Forgot to transfer your password, DB, to Windows. Did you get to experience ads? Oh no. Ads, ads are literally the devil. I need a nif. Oh no, I've already got a nif. All right, this is the workbench. What can we improve? Now I can use that tool I found. Make sure your password is password with a capital P and a one and an exclamation mark. I can make my sling better. I can get more shit. Additional jars. Recycling tool. I'll take the recycling tool, that seems just useful. I can get swag. Nice. That's better. Have I, have I got any other pieces? I don't think I do, do I? No. So now I can recycle We're goodies, good like this NIF. Yes. Let's go. Hint you! No, oh, excuse me. That's you. Thank you. What's over here then? Is there any swag over here? Very solid bush, I have to go around it. Oh. Password boobs! <laughs> Titties. LOL. I think we can get a storm. Once again, graphically, this game is fucking insane. It looks utterly incredible. It really does. Like, they've, d they've done an absolutely phenomenal job of how this looks. It's really impressive. Oh, there's a body here. Nah, he's probably fine. The rats. No. Stabbed. Probably soldiers. He looks fine. Some of these bushes like steel wool and sounds like Velcro when the nickers come off. RIP! They live that style, son. Come on. They're here. They're here too. I told you. No wool can stop them. It's those carcasses. Yes. They keep following the blood. But we sweet, 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 sweet. don't know where the blood stops. Sweet, 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 sweet. Right, we need to make some extra farty, don't we? Fuck off, rats! Oh no, they killed a pig! Rest in peace, pig. Look, some sort of, like, dog here as well. F. <laughs> Can I not go in there without getting ratted? We forgot you. Well, I'll fix it. I didn't expect that. Oh, that damn bastard. I'm afraid we're not done with them. This has to end. Good old Amicia. She really is efficient at braining these nerds. Oh, 
to war against rats. We need like a helmet upgrade. I can go in there, can't I? Is there any more conveniently placed sticks here? There is not. You enjoyed watching the dev diaries of how they made the rats work. I need to actually have a look at that. I think that'd be quite cool. Growing blood. That's all they know. They're soldiers. They just meet with swords. These guys are literally brainer without a second thought. She seems very on edge when she binned anyway. To be fair, I imagine like for a normal person, binning anybody is probably quite stressful. Can you stay right there, you hear? <laughs> God damn it. ways of dealing with, like, actual gribblers. Hide next to these rats. No one will ever think to look for me here. This is unfortunate. I oh, don't mind, we fixed it. I love the spooky rats. I think they're I think they're great. I don't think the enemy AI stuff is very cool. Did this dead man have anything? Well, that's the one I brained, right? Uh, I guess we go this way. For some reason, it seems to be more annoying to just get around the rats in this game. Like there doesn't seem to be many um, doesn't seem to be many like sticks. It's now have to craft the fire stuff more often. Does not. Oh, I don't think they wanted me to do that. Okay, I, I played the game wrong. Whoops. Okay, let's try again. Alright, Noble. What's over here? Uh, so there's no. I, I'm s somewhat horribly shocked that in this lumber yard there is no fucking wood I can use to burn anything, including these sticks on the ground, this stick here. The game is really insistent on like I having to like you're not able to use like sensible regular ways of doing this. Go, my ratty friends. <laughs> How'd you get so vicious? I think it's improved. I don't know, we haven't done much of it yet, to be fair, but... Oh. any good goodies in here. I guess the one thing we want to find is like uh, thingy tools, isn't it? Those seem to be the uh, the big win. 
Can we ha we can hand throw? I guess it's a lot quieter to do that. Yeah. The guy who did the medic in TF2 is Travis Touchdown. Is she allowed to see diamonds at a church? Is that is that legal? Still think you can catch me? That guy, that guy's insistent on like stuff, I guess. I guess we should make a bit of each. There we go. I think they can see quite a long way. Hey, must. I guess we just everything seems clear. What's that? Oh. This way, no doubt. Stay away. Start looking for intruders. Let me know if you see anything. Sure, I will. This is our first time playing Tingle. This is the we played once we played a couple of hours already. We come to the conclusion it's not uh it's not fantastic. It feels weaker than the first game, but that could be because the sort of uh the novelty of the rats is kind of worn off, maybe? The graphics are incredible. Yeah, yeah. What the? What kind of fucking checkpoint is that? What was supposed to do with that exactly? Okay. You think this is over? No, 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 no. Lude. Oh man. Hey KB, thank you very much for the resub, dude. We just run through this then. This is this is not a good checkpoint. Was this supposed to lead you into a false chase sequence? I don't think so. I think it just decided to checkpoint with the guy looking at us for some reason. I don't know if I can actually get out of this now. If I stop crouching, maybe I can just quickly. Okay, just about. Not this way. Not this way. Uh. I get away with this? Really? Fuck. Man, this is a really cursed checkpoint. I'm not quite sure what I'm supposed to do here, really. We can restart the entire checkpoint again, but I don't think we can run the cinematic fan it. Like, I think we can't because this this guy, we'd have to try and brain that guy first if we can. Nope. I think we're left. 
I'm a little bit sad at this checkpoint. I don't really want to restart the entire section. I guess I might have to, though. I think I've got no choice. I think the checkpoint basically fucked me. I don't think you're supposed to fight. You're not supposed to fight, but, like, we're also try trying to get through without getting caught. Oh. I don't think it is a more more men run in dramatic fashion because I can't get past the range guy. You you can't. Like, I'll show you. If you try and run past the range guy, he just kills you. So you'd have to like run and try and brain him. We have to try and get him first, which I can't. No. The window next to me. I can show you, which leads here, which is the same place we were just a second ago. So we can go here, and then try and brain him before he gets us. We still have to like... This is outrageous! Where's my wife? Oh. Shit. I think we're just stuck. I think we're we're just unfortunately stuck. Like... Because we want to get all the way over here, that way. I guess we need to go that way. You can brain his torch. We could do this. Bruh. Bruh, please. You wanna play? Wait till I get my hands on you. I don't you think you can avoid me? Damn. Can't go any further. Helping PM? Project management? Okay, so now he doesn't have a a torch, right? So, will he just stay by the... Will he stay by the thing? I guess he'll just stay by the fire now. I can't I can't really tab out this game very easily. I can check on my phone, maybe. Hold on. This game's a bit funny about timing out. <laughs> Aww. That's so cute. Spark out. Okay, uh... Wait, what? Uh oh. I need some sleep. We've been spotted! Looks like your time's up. I can't reach it! I think we have to restart the session, unless we're very quick about this. Oh, fuck me. No, not over there! Oh, for fuck's sake. Ugh. I swear I pushed X on the other one, but... It seems a bit random whether we get caught or not. Okay. Alright, we did it. Fuck, you know. Alright. Alright, how do we get across here then? That looks awesome. Look how many rats are about there. 
That's cool. Okay. I don't think there's a way we can go this way. I th I could drop a pot if I have one. Why is the crouch underneath thick? Why can't I not crouch with a fucking stick in my hand? Like, why? What purpose would that stop me growing under the fucking thing? I can't do anything with this guy now, like, I think I'm... Ugh. Oh god, I didn't checkpoint us, uh, I've checkpoint us here. Is it me, or is this just, like, fucking awkward? Like, is this just, like, absolutely awkward? <laughs> what am I doing? You fucking checkpointed me here, game. Don't you fucking bass me for doing that. Just why did your play for the first one? Awkward checkpoint into repeated death. Yeah, I didn't luckily didn't have that, but oof. Well, what are you gonna do about now? You got no torch, mate. The guy jumps out the window. He's literally standing on the rat. The rats are climbing him, bruh. I don't you think you can avoid me, Damn bruh. Aren't Fuck there any sticks behind you? No, there are not. Annoyingly. It's we it's almost like they're not reacting to the rats other than they're not allowed in the rat zone when they don't have a torch. Like this guy is just not freaking out the fact there's like a million rats trying to munch him. Weird. What are you doing with my plants? Man's over there still very upset about about things. No. I I had no choice. What? Maybe. But it's done anyway. I had no choice what? Who who died? That wasn't anything to do with me. Lucas. Who got killed? Not yet. Oh god. Oh god. Make it stop. I need 
knife. Because you can't hurt them unless you get like wrap them. You're kind of a bit stuck here, really. I mean, I could just, I could, just, I could lure. Oh no, he's, he's lost us. I think. Where'd you run off to? Come out! Oh, we're supposed to help the herbalist, were we? That was the wrong button. The game cancels your swing completely if you have or you release it as they get close to you. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Oh, oh god. I'll take it, we can't run. No. <laughs> this section is just irritating. Wait, how did he see us that time? Did he just come straight out? I think we we'll just have to restart the session, aren't we? This is over. Here, Amicia. I was hoping we could like brute force it, but I think we can't. All right, let's let's try again. The cow made a mistake in trusting the beast. We don't even know if the people we kill are sick anymore. Where does this stop? The beast is taking action. We need that now. The beast. The men will panic. I know. Oh, that's the wrong button. I guess we just sneak past him. We can't do that without alerting them, though, and we can't put out the. F I could do the pot, we could do we could do both. I'm getting yelled at for like fucking braining people. For the Vermintide. <laughs> Honestly, I think the Skavens would be easier to deal with than these guys. The game's really sort of contrived itself like... Oh shit. Oh, damn it. The game's really contri contrived itself ways of like... Um, uh, not letting you use obvious things around the environment to help you. Like, you could like, I don't know, get a bit of stick wrap some leather to the bottom of it, set fire to the top of the stick, and use that to burn a little bit longer. You could carry multiple sticks, you could do lots of different things, but Amicia is convinced that the only thing she can do is use her rock sling and throw pots. And I don't know why. Like, logically, it doesn't make any sense. Is there any other things? And we can't climb under a table with a stick? Yeah, that was really weird. That was really weird. So we can't go this way unless we set fire to something else, maybe? I can probably use this here and then kill that guy. What are you- What is your fucking problem, you little dickhead? Like, what do you want me to do? Just to like, I don't know, let the soldiers see us? Like, what? what what's the goal of this dickhead here? To what, What's your point? You're really irritating. Remember what we're here for? What, to not die? Yes, I do also recall that. Like, what is your point here? Stupid little boy. Be quiet. 
Don't take sass off you, I'm too old for that shit. Right, we're back at the, ch the cursed church. I don't really want to go back in the church, honestly, but... Did the devs forget the first game happened? Or something? I don't quite know what the what's going on really with that. It's a bit weird. Maybe the canon way of playing the first game was killing nobody? But she always she already says that she killed a lot of people, so I don't know. Strange. I think they want you to sneak through here completely unseen. Uh, to be fair, to be fair to the game, it is a stealth game. Fucking Lucas would rather just get killed. That, that's just clearly what what Lucas is getting at here. Amicia, please, please, what, mate? What, what are you getting at? So how did he die last time? Is it, did the two guards run off when they saw me? Is that what it was? You did it. You killed them all. I want to see my wife. I have to do something. No. Oh. I had no choice. Maybe, but it's done anyway. All right, I'll, I'll reset that. Like, I don't understand why his torch went out when he dropped to the floor. Hey, Curtis. Getting rid of a new vampire, the masquerade, Ven as a venture based on magic, that should be really fun. That should be a really good one. I hope you enjoy the run, man. Go to hell. Amicia, please. Amicia, please, stop protecting us with your with your uh, your skills. I'd rather us die. Sure, Lucas, I'd also rather us die. What a sensible boy you are. I think we should absolutely not hurt the people who are trying to kill us. That would be terrible. You should keep telling me in my ear over and over again how bad that is. Because that's really fun. Thanks, Lucas. Oh, tabletop. Oh, interesting. Okay. That'll also be really cool. How you just save this guy? I think what you're supposed to do is... What? 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 I guess you aggro the guard from his expected path and then immediately the rats jump behind and bin the guy. That's insane. Like what so, so you can't experiment with this. You you have to do something the game wants you to do. Go to hell. Amicia, please. I love making Lucas sad now. I guess we gotta wait until they get closer or something. This is like walking in with extra steps. I think the game is determined that you've got to do it this a certain way, right? You did it. You killed them all. I want to see my wife. Listen, it's been a damn long day, and my sword's still warm. So. So you can't. To do something. They're surrounded by rats. Well, you want me to help you? Ha! You're all dead already. Listen, herbalist. Stop right now. Yeah. So what I want to do is hit the bag on over there, to my right, in front of me, with the sling. But we can't really do that, can we? You'll all be sick soon. Can I hand throw the rock? Laugh, it's too far. To Stop on your knees now. He's going to kill him. Oh, this time I was allowed to do that. Sling. Oh wait. <laughs> the 
in the heart. Yeah, the Kerbin just calmly, like, dies. If the game doesn't want me to do that, why do I get the option to do it? Like, what's the point? Oh, okay. Well, so what What do we think the game wants us to do here? Like, that. that's, that's the next question. What, what are we expected to do? If we're not allowed to do what we want, let, let's find out what the game wants us to do and see what we can make with that. Stop. Amicia, please. Longest possible route would take time until the banter? You think that's what it is? Do you reckon? Let's just sit here and wait then and see what the game wants us to do. Maybe we need to. We can't distract the guard because the herbalist just commits dishonorable Sudoku against the rats. So, so I don't think I can touch the guy at all because the, the herbalist will just kill himself for some bizarre reason. Even though he knows that's what's keeping him alive is the light. So he should move with the guard when he goes to investigate. Other players are doing anti-social Toreador, who used to be an investigative journalist, a nerdy Tremere Shutton, a Bruja, he's not a Sombra, who defected. <laughs> Games to be set in Seattle. Oh, that'd be fun. You have to let us know how the game goes. That sounds like a good laugh. I want to see my wife. Throw a light Please bomb near Herb Boy. Okay. So, we, so we, we set him off and then immediately pot you to protect to him. You? Okay. You're all dead already. Listen, you're all right now. And I'll laugh as I watch you die. Oh, that cracks it. I can't throw it far enough. It's over. Not yet. I know what it is. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think he's just guaranteed to die? No, that that can't be. That's that's incredibly stupid. That's that's like incredibly super stupid, right? Amicia, please. Amicia, please. I actually, I've gotten to the point I'm not even mad anymore. I'm actually going to go out my way to upset this little fucking prick. Every time he doesn't like something, I'm going to go out my way to do it. I think the banter time is meant to be sneaking somewhere. So sitting and listening puts you out of sequence. So do we sneak a past then? Don't look at them if it upsets you. This is not the rats doing. You did it. You killed them all. We have to do something. No, I want to see my friends. No. I had no choice. Maybe. But it's done anyway. Let's not stay here. The night chief Lucas. I see. Not yet. I know what it is. So sneaking behind him just undoes that. So you you can't get too close to him, otherwise he just breaks his uh, his his event anyway. Still think you can catch me? I broke the script by moving too close. Yeah. So we can't get too close, and we can't shoot him. Can we save him? Is, or is it is this, is this guy toast? Go, to hell. Go for it, brother. Go on, sort me, sort me. It's outrageous. I'm, I'm actually finding it slightly more entertaining to, to like see how busted this is as opposed to actually playing at this point, but... You can save him, you gain literally nothing. No dialogue, no cutscene, no... Wait, what? What the fuck? And my sword still warm. How do you save him then? We have to do something. They're surrounded by rats. Well, you want me to help you? Ha! You're all dead already. Listen, herbalist. Stop right now. You'll all be sick soon. And what I'll if I sneak closer, drop the fire pot oh, to protect now. him, and then I um <laughs> and then I hit him. Should we try that way? You kneel if you want any help from me, dog. No, Here we go. The line. So now I'm gonna. There we go. So he's protected against the rats. Perfect. Don't come too close. Okay. 
No, it wasn't in work. You won't get me today. He fell over, so that's not gonna work. I'm determined to save this man's life out of sheer spite. Amicia, please. Yeah, you might be right, Cleverly Bond, honestly. What are you doing with my is this game better than the first one? And in so much ways. <laughs> I'm not a reviewer, mate, but... Uh, so far, no, it's, it's far worse. In more or less every way. The story hasn't been as interesting so far. The mechanics seem more annoying. The rat seems buggier. The dialogue seems weirder. It's definitely prettier, though. So, I'm gonna look this up. Let's have a look. I can't tab out, because, uh, oh look, sleepy kitty. I can't tab out, so I'll, uh, what's this called? Playing tail, requiem, save the herbalist. IGN have got us. Let's have a look. You'll see two guards guiding a herbalist from out behind the locked door. He isn't long with this world, but you can save him. Okay. The guards will kill the herbalist. This is supposed to happen. You are not meant to save the herbalist. Oh, well, there we go then. Should you want to, though, your best bet is to extinguish the fire on the small mound to the right where the cart is with the dead bodies from a distance as possible by hitting the saltpeter bag. This lures most of the rats there. Then approach the door to trigger the herbalist and the guards. Watch for the guard on your left, the herbalist's right, to break off from the left. Quickly sling and extinguish on his torch, and then the same for the other guard. If you're quick and lucky, the rats in the area will be preoccupied with the cart and the two guards, letting the herbalist stand there alive. The bad news is, you gain absolutely nothing. There is no cutscene, no narrative changes, no dialogue, no reward, no interaction collectible or achievement trophy. The herbalist will just stand in one place doing nothing, and you have to progress to the next area as normal. As such, you are actively wasting resources to save the herbalist that are better used elsewhere, like saving it for a tougher enemy field area coming up next. I see. Just see my wife! Listen, it's been a damn long day, and my sword's still warm, so. We have to do something. They're surrounded Lead. by rats. What, you want me to help kill the sick soon? And I'll laugh as I watch you die. Stop! It's gotta be them. <laughs> Damn bastard. The night chief Lucas. What a shame. It's over. Not yet. I know what it looks like. We can still do this. No, I just need to find the herbalist. Just try to calm down. You won't make it. Back. With this character's death, I prefer to the prophecy is severed. Yeah. Rip. Good game design, isn't it? This is fucking dog shit, isn't it? Oh man. That's really sad. Oh, we all did it sometime. Okay. You're done for now! I'll find some way to get my hands on you! The dumb thing is, because of this, you can't actually get across here now, because if you turn this on, he'll be able to come across. So I'd have to open this up, extinguish it when he was a little bit closer, and get him killed. We have to do something. Generally, in a video game, that means you should do a thing, but I know. Yeah! Like, this is kind of. Yeah! At least have one of the guys argue against saving him if you can't. Like, this is fucking terrible, isn't it? Oh, man, what how I, I didn't think the first one was, like, the best game I'd ever played, but I thought it was fairly solid, but this is just poor. Like, there is no... There was no real gameplay decision here. It was just... The game... The game had already decided you can't do anything. It was also like this. You just don't remember. Yeah, maybe. Maybe I'm... Maybe I'm... Thinking back on it, perhaps. Thank you for the biddies, no one.
He's not. He still thinks the rats are there, I guess. I'm stuck here, but it won't last, you know. You're not stuck here, though. You're, you're fine. I, I made it so you could actually get across here. Oh no, it's checkpoint! Uh, you won't try and cross? Why not? Wait, what? <laughs> the rats like the taste of 14 year old French girl over this guy. Can I bring the one behind him? Let's see. I can't, no, the game won't let me target it. It's actively not letting me target it, in fact. Okay, I have a plan. We have to turn this one on, and then we get close. Excuse me, sir. Oh, oh. oh this time he turned up. Okay. All right, we're good. Oh, all right then. Please have something useful. I know we're spending a lot of time on this one section, but I'm kind of making a point. I'm kind I'm I'm being I'm being a little bit of a weenie, but I'm kind of making a point here. Okay, so where do we want to go here? Over there, I guess. Point needs to be made to justifiably uninstall, agreed. Full spy mode, literally. Go spike, you know what I mean, don't you, son? Go spike for or go home, innit? So there's sticks there. There is, in fact, sticks here. And you get a Oh, Sona, dude! Everybody gets loot. Sona, you fucking giga chad. Thank you so much, man. That's really, really nice of you. Thank you so much. Seriously, man, thank you so, so much. You're really kind. <laughs> the game really doesn't want you to do that, does it? It really, really doesn't want you there. Something thank you, Sono. I'm so jealous that I could, I also couldn't shit in Hulk Hogan's toilet. I'm a bit sad about that. If I was one of the shit anywhere, I wanted to be in Hulk Hogan's toilet. I know the game has to continue, but there's so... This all hacks me off, right? Hold on. I'm going to be spiteful. Let's be spiteful. How much wood can we, in all fairness, reliably count that could be used to set fire to something? Okay. Let's have a look. Well, firstly, this could be taken. It's very shallow into the ground, as you can see. So we could feasibly pull that out. Maybe you could argue that Amy here couldn't quite, like, do that. 
this fucking goon maybe might be able to help us as well. So that's one. If we if we're being fair, maybe zero. We we can that. Now, firewood won't necessarily catch fire instantly if it's not dry. It could take a bit of time. You you could argue that that ginormous pile of fucking wood here we can't use to set fire to something. But let's have a look. There's a stick here that would burn. Absolutely. That's a dry stick. That's a dry stick. Uh, there is a axe handle that we could actually genuinely stick into the fire, and I imagine that would probably catch fire a little bit. But would it be enough to stop the rats? Mm, could argue. <laughs> look at this one. What a king. I respect it. Sweet, 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 sweet. Uh, we've got some dried sticks over here. We've got more burning embers here. Yeah, you know. Dry grass. We couldn't pick up one of the torches that the guards dropped. Uh, have we we stabbed a guy, right? Where's the guy we stabbed? No, seriously, where is the guy we stabbed? He vanished. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. I'm in the forbidden land. Let me just leave. He's he's no longer in existence, but he should have had a torch, I guess. So are we counting the giant pack of dry firewood, the fire stick, the axe handle that we could use, uh, the sticks on the ground, the dry grass, the torch we could take, or are we saying there's actually nothing we could probably, uh, was that a dev loot bin down there? Uh, I don't see one. See some trees, some rocks. No ratties under the ground, that's a bit disappointing. Oh wait! There is some ratties over here though. Ooh, ooh. ooh move not. I love your tangents. Do you like me being spiteful? Is everyone enjoying my my spite my spite tangent? Maybe it's some magic fire. So we want to sneak around and get here, right? Is there something we can use? They're soldiers? They're dead, guys. There, there are no soldiers. They're, they're all dead. I don't know what you're talking about. So I could make two pots. I could do one. Then I could do two, two, two. Amicia? Oh, we're out of pots. Fuck. Fuck. Get a shovel and launch rats on the guards. That'd be genuinely funny. There's some sticks here. We'll have to take a stick, I guess. Do you know, there's also... Since I'm on a rant, right? <laughs> Lucas! Lude. You big fucking useless cunt. Why are you not picking up a stick? You have two hands. Pick up a stick. Amicia, can we beat this boy with the stick? Can I at least do that? He needs both of them to give you the middle fingers. Hey, almost the big 40. Thank you, see you night. Thanks, man. I really appreciate the uh, constant support, dude. Thank you. Come along then, you useless fucking sack of shit. Let's go. I'm going to walk over here to this big bundle of sticks that we can also use as opposed to the fucking sticks on the fucking ground. But that's okay. Careful you don't accidentally, like, fucking piss on the saltpeter and have it explode in your face and be here. Alright, let me, let me do some more fire. Yeah, thanks for holding all the sticks here, Lucas. Really good. Let's go. Okay, I'm being, I'm more or less being facetious at this point. Obviously gameplay reasons, but you know, come on. Drawing blood. That's all they know. What do you mean drew? They're just me. Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> If you'd have carried two sticks, you little shit, we could have lit the brazier. But no, now I have to waste some more resources so I can throw fire at the brazier. Play Ancestors of Humankind, Aussie. Can tell men to pick up sticks all day in that game. <laughs> Sounds like a fucking riot, son. Ah, oh, they've locked it. Calm down. It's an ancient wall. There might be another way. Yes. The 
the rats have just they're banned from this side. No more rats allowed. This is story Follow moment. Me. Imagine Larian designed these rat encounters and how much fun and duty we've had throwing rats, starting a fire with oil. I know. Th th the thing is, the thing is, if if I'm bit no, I'm gonna have a rant. I need a Pepsi. I I need I need my angry Pepsi before I do this. In my angry Beppis. Right. The thing is, this game's clearly designed as a, uh, like a, a small, free, like a small amount of puzzles plus a little bit of player agency walking simulator, isn't it? Like, like Emmy was mentioning earlier. Yeah, it was Emmy. It was exactly Amicia was just the only non-useless fucker in the game. Like this, this is supposed to be. A narrative experience where you are doing what the dev the devs generally what the devs want you to do. Tell me, tell me it's here. We're at the herbalist. But the problem is, I'm not a game designer, and let's preface that obviously, right? I'm just a loudmouth. But if you are setting up a scenario where there are multiple ways of doing something, but you make the multiple ways of doing something non-optimal and not very fun or just flat out broken and don't work, then there there really isn't much to that, in which case you might as well take the agency away from me and make the narrative more interesting. Oh, go for it, Crab. Go ham. It's, it's just a shame. It's just a bit of a shame. And you make fake sign... Like, you make, like... Fake signposts and vague hints. Yeah, you could possibly say something you can't. There was a game reviewer who joined Larian Suit as a game designer, and he says he's more strict on game devs now. <laughs> yeah, I bet, actually. Now he sees what it's about. Max and Spike was called for. I think it was. There's trees and shit all over the place. Just climb over it. Yeah, there's loads of stuff, Pete, that you could do. Like, there's, there's a certain point where you have to let the game do its thing if you're playing a narrative experience, right? But it's kind of like watching Avengers Infinity War. It's not very fun when everyone acts like a fucking dickhead. Like, and none of it makes any sense. You'll sit there in the cinema, and you're watching these supposed adults, who are supposed to be earth finest heroes, like, make dumb call after dumb call after dumb call. And that's why when you read the boys' comic, and you go, you know what? Garth Innes was right. These guys fucking suck, and you need a load of people to bin them. That'll teach them a lesson. Another PM. Is this more cat related? Let's have a look. <sighs> I actually stopped following this cunt. Fuck that prick. How long has he been streaming for, Sam? Not that I want to, like, pee pee shame, but I want to pee pee shame a little bit. Let's not go that <laughs> Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's not go that far. Innis I like Garth Innes' stuff. He's very silly, but. I've gotten blocked as well. It just showed up now on the side. That's pretty that's pretty cursed. I think though, if you're gonna build a narrative experience, and what I'm sort of getting at, if you're building a narrative experience, it has to make logical sense to keep me engaged. This is me personally. Some other people might feel a bit different about this, but I want the world to have a logical sense to it. At the moment, the game is showing me that the rats are not scary to the enemies. They are no longer interested. They will happily run through rat sections, which the first game showed, and Amicia herself cannot do. She will very slowly have the torch down, low to the ground, sweeping, to get rid of the rats. But the guards will now sprint through. So it, the game is telling me that the rats are no longer a threat to the enemies, for some reason. And then the AI sort of falls apart after that, but shrug. It just... It's just kind of messy here. Oh, was I wrong about the first game? Maybe I was wrong about... Maybe I, I remember the first game being kind of fun. And I enjoyed it. I thought it was long. And some of the puzzles were wasting my time a little bit. But... Yeah. It was the same. Maybe I'm just getting old, son. I'm starting to forget. 
Maybe because I've played the first game. Look for a purple flower in the shape of a star. Maybe because I played the first game, I'm now a bit like a bit more, you know. This looks like lavender. No, that's not it. It started good. I think the rats. I think the rats are a really interesting thing. Like, yeah, I think the rats are an interesting mechanic. I think the rats as a plague, seeing them burst through walls and like tidal waves of rats, is really cool. Like, legitimately cool. I think, I think the rat stuff is awesome, and I really, really enjoy it. No flowers here. Oh, Lord, focus, focus. It's a fucking leaf. We're here now. It's all right. Oh no, not the right shape. There's nothing here, Lucas. I know. Nothing here but rats. The, house. Yes. the game was designed by Skaven. <laughs> fucking Skaven. Oh, here's the guy's wife. The florist. The herbalist's wife. They killed her. <laughs> nah, t knowing her, she probably just stood there while the rats ate her. Beep boop, my AI has nothing to do with this. I will stand here and die. Beep boop, I have no self-preservation instinct. Beep boop. That's the one thing they must get right in a rat-based game is the rats. That's true. That's true. If you don't get the ratties right, then you're... What are you doing? But... Beep boop. Beep boop. God, me tools. Oh, you must be joking. It's all junk. No, wait. And now what? I'm not even there for him. How will we even get back? <laughs> Hands are sweaty. <laughs> Mama's spaghetti. Hands are sweaty. The thing, narratively, though, <laughs> he's weak. Yeah. <laughs> Arms are heavy. <laughs> That's what I thought as well. <laughs> wrong? Your opinion's your opinion. You can't be wrong about that. Your mind might have changed. Yeah, it could be. I don't know. I just... Like I said, I remember the puzzles were wasting our time. Like, terribly. Like, there was a lot of puzzles. Like, the one that becomes in particular, do you remember the fort? Where there was, like, trenches of rats and we had to move the light very slowly around the fort. And I was just like, Jesus fucking Christ, this is just wasting my time. Like, you could have done this at eight times the speed and it'd been fine. But the other thing is, right, her mum is with Hugo right now. The alchemist crazy Superman that we went to go rescue is with Hugo right now. He's probably with the best people actually possible right now. But, you know. It's like when you drunkly ring up an ex after completely forgotten why you've broken up. <laughs> yeah. Then you suddenly realise that when she like tries to like break into your house or whatever or set fire to your hamster. I remember none of the plague tale, my brain appears to compartmentalise those memories and burn them. I really I don't know, I just for some reason I, I remember looking forward to this. I I maybe I just Maybe I was just wrong. Again, graphics are beautiful for this, though. Absolutely stunning. Look for any valuables. We need food, drugs, any goods. No. They're going in. You were probably hoping for a better version of the first game. Do do? Yeah. Hey. What? You're not alright. I am. No, you're not. You're not even breathing right now. Do you think that's air you're breathing? Dizzy. My heart's pounding. Hands sweaty. Soldiers are going to seize everything. We've got to get the, the nightshade before they do. I have to. No. Let me see spaghetti. I no state to do this. I'm going. I'll sneak in. I can do it. Cartoon angry Magneto. Whoa, 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 whoa. What happened there? I will run. Upsetting. It's not my first time. You'll run? You don't fucking do anything, mate. You play as him now? No, I don't think so. I think we have to play as Mum Spaghetti Girl. I think the PTSD thing is fine. Like, jokes aside, I think it's fine. Nothing wrong with that. I think the idea that someone would be fucking traumatised from the rat encounters and all the people she binned is perfectly understandable, especially for someone her age. I think that's absolutely fine. I don't think, overall, narratively, the game has been okay. I think it's just messy, though. There's just been a lot of stuff that's just overly messy. Case in point, where we found the alchemist, and within five seconds, it's, 
I am Alchemist. Hi, are you Alchemist? Yes, you are now Defender of of Boy with Rats. I am not Defender of Boy. Calls you Defender of Boy. It hard cuts to, like, them in the house. How did we get back there? Did we, we made it okay. The city was full of rats. I guess there was a secret way. Go do thing. Click. Shuts door. Uh, okay, so now he's now he's looking after Rat Boy. Okay, uh, now we're outside and it's raining. What? What? what, what? Like... Like, that entire segment was just bizarre. It's like a bit was missing. Oh my god, Lucas, you had one fucking job. Wait. Move quick. This fucking kid. Alright, we'll just cl climb up here then. Why did you let him go by himself? Are you stop, stop being weak. Stop being scared. Go. Lucas, he's alive. Bastards. When I'm Amicia doesn't like the way the preacher talks about her brother, which we never heard. Oh, yeah. Nothing good ever happened to these games. I remember that from the first game, too. Yeah, I mean, I, I actually don't mind that. We made a bit of a running joke about that in, um, <laughs> in Stellar Blade as well. Everything is miserable 100% of the time. That guy has a helmet, yeah. Is this what Hellblade was like? Um, no, Hellblade was... There was no enemies particularly in Hellblade. Oh? Oh dear. You had your chance to run. I was just sorry. I was just drinking Pepsi while I was. Uh, I just figured I'd reload the checkpoint, trying to get caught. So. Oh, it hard checkpoint me slightly further away. Oh no, it didn't. It's mm, wait. Am I? Uh. Oh no, no. I'm okay. Yeah. All right. Lucas, get the nightshade. Get out. Kill whoever tries to stop you. As long as he doesn't directly walk into you, I think it's fine. I actually think this is- I have actually enjoyed this much more than I enjoyed Hellblade, to be fair. I thought Hellblade was utterly, utterly, like, dull. I think you have to- you have to sort of like those kind of experiences for, like, Hellblade and stuff, and that's just not my- not my jam at all. I, f I find Hellblade uncomfortable to listen to. Like, the constant whispering in my ear I found very uncomfortable. I don't like it. I don't like when people do that to me. So, playing a game like that was just, like, horrible. Kitty. I actually don't mind movie games, like, at all. I, 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 in fact, I thoroughly enjoy them. I just need my narrative experience to be a bit more consistent. What a lotus one with that place. You think they're looking for drugs too? Same as us. Bastards. You will pay. Amicia, no! Oh, survive. Thanks. This one learned his lesson. Mangy dogs. Hey, forget about him. I found the nightshade. We have to go now. Wait, you found nightshade in the woods? My god, that's incredibly unlikely. If France is anything like Britain, which, you know, it kind of is, you'll be able to find it in the woods. I heard sounds in the bar. They're coming. Go hide. I'll hand them. No, we got what we need. Let's leave now. No. They'll come after us, and I'm done running away. Man down! We've got an intruder here! Alert! Alarm! Come, I'm right here. Yeah. There you go! Lucky these ones all got no helmets. See? They're nothing! No! 
nothing to be scared of. Amicia, what are you doing? We have to go. No! I'm tired of being afraid. I'll show them that it's over. Come, I'll give you what you want. He has a shield. Careful. <laughs> He has a shield, be careful! They'll keep coming if we don't go! Go if you want! This is my ground now! This is where they die! Oh yes, come then! Show me how you'll do it! That's all you've got! Come on! Rob, you're just scared! You have to drive! Stop auto-locking onto the fucking bag! Stop it! It's Stop! Fuck! Ah! Look at him! Right. In there. Put in that place. Yes, come, come try. Look, this is how it works now. I set the rules. Enough. They are ah! in our hands. No, it's in mine now. You're dead. You're gonna have dead. Yes, Amicia. She's got fucking ham. Ah! No. Why would you hit the shield? Uh, uh, excuse me. E excuse me. We did you just kill like 20 people in a row? Don't expect a quick death after what you've done. We've paid the executioner to spend a bit of time with you before you hang. Well, that's good. It's nice to have a hobby in it. You should sit down. Oh, so that's all you have to say. Oh, fuck off, Lucas. Shut up. Come you guys have kidnapped. You can do better than that. The reason we got. In here. Why don't you really let go? No. Fuck her, sharp. Do you see the situation we're in? We were just supposed to get hers. How do you think Hugo feels right now? Legolas. How he feels when his sister is I hanging. made a mistake. <sighs> I don't know what's happening to me, Lucas. I I feel my mind going. Yes. Do you know? This I think Amicia would be good in hunt. I think she'd be a good hunter. Just go in the bayou. Just fuck up people with a sling. <laughs> Funk. It hurts. And it keeps hurting. And you want to hurt it back. You think she'd be good like Dafty? But it's a fight you cannot win. Oh, we're gonna get rat powers. That'd be cool. Like Corvo. You are not them. You are at the room. Thing works with fire. I'll tell you when I'm ready. Get out. I know she killed a lot. I know she killed a lot of people, but do you think when you're like hanging children by the noose that you're the bad guys? Do you think that any of them looking around each other like, do you think we're doing the right thing? Or like, I think she's. I think that what they're implying is she got PTSD. Stop there. And then she, then we'll she, for the then she went ham. You must be finishing one right now. Cave in front of the beast. Run. You're cold meat now. Food no. for the crows. <laughs> Lucas, stairs. Run. You won't last. <laughs> what was I think that helmet would have God protected them a little bit. You'll get used to it. That was not efficient. Wow. They still have my sleigh. <laughs> They have my sling, I have to get my braining sling back. You saved our skin down there. Yes, yes. Where to now? There should be a walkway. There's a window there. A, a roof? I feel we should have taken that helmet. 
It overlooks the roof, Lucas. No choice. Oh. Oh. Lord, that's high. Is it safe? Sort of. Come. Oh, wow. This is really not safe at all. Shh. Calm down. Come nice view, though. I Damn. It's the only way out of here. Are you joking? No. This game does not fail to impress when it comes to the graphics. It is, oh, please, it is a hell of a looker. Please, it, it's really nice. Do it. Sorry to put you through this. This is my fault. I honestly don't care right now. There's another roof. Pop in. Evil pop in. Get up this roof. Please. I like I hope we can continue to feel Amicia's bloodlust. Like, I wanna say every time we kill someone now, she starts to laugh and eventually she's like smearing blood all over herself. Like you kill someone, like she's like, mmm. Starts like rubbing over her forehead. God, I can't do anything. Let's pass it quietly. I can't do anything. If only there were some weapons in here we could do something with. If only there were some Weapons we could do something with. Sadly, there isn't, so, you know. More acquisitions? Uh huh. From the outskirts, which is District 8. Ah, you're the ones who met that crazy girl, right? That bloody witch in her sling. But the beast's got her. So we've got enough meat to hold out for a week. There's a progression map that it depends on the way you tackle encounters. There is, there is, and it depends on um, how you do them. Though it doesn't need to be every encounter, it seems to be selected points of the story, I'm guessing. The nightshade might be in it. Maybe you'll sleep too. We can't take the risk. You go need us. We'll do without. It's wiser, yes. Another god. Why you won't move? But there's a fire. Do you still have some of your smoke thing? The student fetch you. Yeah, Lucas, throw a stupid fat you. Will do. Flipendo. We don't have much time. Again, you could argue, like, narratively, that Amicia does not know how to use a bow, right? Like, you could argue that. But that doesn't explain all the axes and shit that would be genuinely quite useful. Yes. Let's go back to our house. What's the point of stocking up for a siege? I'm not saying people won't panic, but a riot? They want to flee this city. The problem will be. Do you know where I'm going? No. Just pushing forward. Are you finished, by the way? Under the table. Quick. Oh, no. Cleaning the depot. I'll be doing just that for two days. Let me take my break, goddammit. She wants her plus three spec bonus, yeah. No blame her. She wants to min max. Surely after the event of the last game, learning how to use another weapon might be a good idea. Let's go. I think the problem is any any sort of I can't sleep with all this going on. Any sort of way of um, defending yourself more than the bulk standard kind of breaks the immersion of the stealth stuff, right? She's not supposed to be able to do this because that's what the game's decided. Like the first game, you could argue she was a rich nobles kid who was okay with a sling, and that's it. But six months now, she should be like. She should be fucking ass fucking McGee, like Lord S of like braining people. How often are we finding arrows? More often than I'd like to think. I mean, an arrow would do the job. You could jam an arrow in someone's neck. I let everybody down. What? We've literally cleansed the world of like 30 decades. Like, I think that's a plus, honestly. Is like Ezio still being the basic shit he was at the start of Brotherhood as he was in Assassin's Creed 2? Yeah. Wouldn't make a lot of sense. The meat is also pissing me off like the perfect distillation of a game not letting you play a game but forcing you to act a part in the play. Yeah, way down. Again, I'm, I'm oh. actually okay with that to a certain extent. I think we found that depot. Really? Yes, you're right. So that means the nightshade should be somewhere here. Look, there's a car that we need to knock down right. with our sling when we find it. I'll look for my sling. We may need it. Right. Nightshade. I hope it's still in my pouch. Again, with with the sort of narrative ones, 
Um, this is actually better not having the weapon. I think they get nothing. This weapons. swords, knives. Yes. Oh, no sling. <laughs> Let's go. Oh! It's fine. We don't need any of those fucking weapons. Okay. Somewhere else. Let's pray no one comes in. Or with none. Yes, let's pray no one comes in when we're unarmed. Agreed. Powders. Keep looking. What's that? <sighs> no. Come on, come on. Oh, what a mess. This is, this is me and Wrath of the Righteous desperately looking for that plus three bow, but I can't find it, and so my character's getting nothing Please. at all. They could come in at any time. Well, that's tough luck for you, Ember. You get to go unarmed then, don't you, you little shit? Let's keep this for later. Come on, where's that nightshade? Where did they put it? Don't you talk shit about Ember? I actually really like Ember. I would never talk shit about her. Maybe here? Please. I know she's schmoll. She's schmoll girl, but like... A lot of useful things here. Yeah, I think there's definitely some weapons here she could utilize pretty well. I've got the nice shade, Amicia. Finally. This hasn't been for nothing. Always trust Looks an locked. alchemist's nose. Now I just need my sling, and we'll leave. I'll go check the door. Oh, here you are. I've got it. Da 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 da. Right. I know. Let's get to the door and get out of here. Careful with it. Where's Lucas? Fuck you, little shit. Fair play. You can actually hit it. That's kind of fun. Open with a niff. I will open it with a niff. Oh, damn. It's like in The Last of Us. I broke a knife, but it was worth it. Plenty of things in here. I should keep an eye out. There could be more of those chests. Well, this is an upgrade, Slag. Okay. What, what else do I get? No, 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 no! Loot the things on the side! Why is everything the same fucking button? Right. Loot those first. Alright. Let's get to work. <laughs> she was like a cat. She had to do like a circuit before doing it. I like narrative games. Remember, I played the quarry until dawn. No, no, yeah, yeah, for sure, yeah, sure. But sometimes games fail at both those things. They fail to commit either, and the elements don't fit together. This is that kind of game. I haven't played it so secondhand fury. Yeah, it's definitely being a bit strange with stuff. I think. With traveler's tools and upgrade, no, upgrade it without using a workbench. No, I don't care about that. Oh, I see you. But... Oh no, those are those are terrible. Oh no, you shouldn't do stuff like that. That that's that's naughty. That this the you can use an unbreakable tool to upgrade equipment without tool cost. So this this is the equivalent of like those terrible XP bonuses things you get sometimes in trees, where to to play correctly, what you should be doing is taking the XP. Like, you should take the XP bonus, because if you don't take the XP bonus, then you're going to be missing out and, like... I was going to play Crow Country. I was, yeah. I've got it all downloaded. I've got it all downloaded and ready to go. I wanted to try this, though. Like, I remembered, like, I wanted to do the sequel to the game we've already played, to be sort of, sort of sure. Unfortunately, it ended up being, like, me sort of not being so keen. Alright, what well, sling. I can be soft sling. I'll, soft, I'll softly. I'll softly the sling. Much better. A second cradle. I can shoot a second time before reloading. I had that in the first game. They stun enemies for longer. I want an upgrade that lets me brain twats with helmets, but never mind. Yeah, there does seem to be a bit of a trend of protagonists nattering overly. I mean, Gloven does it in The Witcher 3 quite a lot as well. Wind telling. Before we go, don't know, don't care. You don't want to go out there, believe me. Damn, the gate is right there. They're too many. We can't sneak past them, and we can't stay either. We need a plan. I don't know. This place is full of 
things? Let's take a look around. Of course. You see what I see? What? Up there. The ballista. Listen. I've gathered enough materials here to make a large quantity of stupefaccio. No. So we stick the paste to the tip of the bolt, shoot it, and hopefully the friction from the impact King's bounty too. And we'll Globus of Nazi. Weird. If it works. We don't have any better ideas. Let's get that ballista down. There's a crank up there. How Skill checks become tougher if you level up, I really? Don't see anything. There has to be something. Hey, don't make four men. We're doubling the head count on patrol. We must hurry. There'll be even more soon. Well, I don't know. This place is a mess. There could be. <laughs> I found a cart. Skip yes. up, skip leave up. I'm a scared Let's man. Get that in <laughs> Use the ballista. How's the game want me to do this? They're far too quiet. The mess in town must be playing to our advantage. Yes. You found the card. Sorry. It's me not paying attention. I was laughing too much at the dance. We can climb up on it now. Oh no. Oh I gotta oh I gotta stick it up there. Sorry. That makes way more sense. Like even though they're nattering quite a bit, I like um and though Lucas is annoying, I, I like both their voice actors. I think they're both doing a pretty good job actually. No cranking it on stream. Here we go. There's a weird like flickering effect in here that's kind of funny. I don't know if you can see it on stream. It's aggravating. Wait. I know this. Lucas, they have a map of Guyen. Really? What's it doing here? I don't know. Here's the ocean. The lake. Home was. It was around here, yes. I'm ready for the cat. I think so. I think so. I think I've done everything. with this right now. Yes. It's all in the past. I think I've done as much as I can. You're never ready, yeah. I've done, I think I've done as much as I can. I've done even more tidying up and some stuff today. I've been I've been cleaning everything. I've been trying to cat proof as much as I can. I've got the side on the PC now, like I've got the mesh on there, sort of protecting that as well. Cleaned up any like loose wires that I don't need just to make sure they're out of the way. Go. Oh, this thing is heavy. Have you ever used something like this before? Of course not. <sighs> what? Oh, there's a counterweight. I could handle the crank if you want. Yes. There has to be a way to get rid of that chain. Wait, I, I pull it down again, then he holds it. it? Do I have a sluice site runes you don't open the front door going out and they have access to? Unfortunately not, no, so I'm gonna have to just be careful. There has to be a way to get rid of that chain. Oh yeah, hold the button to make him crank Lucas, it. That's there we go. Your job. Naturally. Down we go. Cat stream tomorrow. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. I imagine I'll be like scared out of the little wits and I'll probably be wanting just to, you know, do their own thing. So, we'll see how they're feeling. The chain's cut. You can let go. Good. Let's get it to the door, quick. You have to try and sort that. I mean, they're eventually going to be outdoor cats. So it's not going to be much of a big problem, but it's, um... For now, I'm going to have to be a little bit careful. Wish I got chains of stones. Hardcore. They'll hide for a bit. That's what I'd imagine as well, yeah. I know. If we fail, Hugo will be alone and and we'll die. And we don't want that. Fucking peacock. Let's stop here. Wait. The 
stupefaccia. This is crazy, Lucas. I think we're past that point. <sighs> All right. It's set. Yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do about the front door. I've tr I tried to think about some stuff, but I I literally it just goes out to the front door bit. So I know I'll, I'll have to sort of think. You're watching stream a few years ago and his cat zoomed past the PC and pressed the reset BIOS button on the back of his PC. That's quite funny. Yeah, I figured they'd hide for a bit, yeah. Can't limit off the room the front door is in. That's where their home base is, basically. That's that's their, their area, because that's the biggest, quietest bit of the house initially. Yeah, I'm in the country. The side arms it. I'm on it. So, when do you open the doors? I won't. Shoot through it. We need friction to get the reaction. What? But we don't even know if it will go through. Too late for that. Alright. Back we go. Get ready. I am. What took you so long? Poor I guess we guy. got through the, the rest of town, all right? Arrived. We had to wait, but we have everything. We shall give this to him. Yes, we've lost enough time already. How is he? Exhausted. He fell asleep when it calmed down. Please He's tell fine. him. He's fine. He's in good hands. The best you can be sure. I hope so, for your sake. Huh. Don't. I know it's hard, but it has to be done. It's been two days. How can you stand there and do nothing? Very easily. He doesn't deserve this. I'm taking him out of this. Harry reaching don't. the last threshold is a very rare event. A critical one. Of course, from now on, we need to isolate him. The Order has special buildings. You want to lock him away? Do you know what your brother is capable of? He will do much worse. Hey! He's a child! This is not his fault! And the more you hurt him, the more rats are out there, and the more people die! This is why we need to take him away. His power will grow stronger as his days draw shorter. Magister, please. What? what do you mean? Amicia, Hugo is condemned. The last threshold means the death of the carrier. No. There must be a way. Lucas Your managed... friend bought you time when your brother reached the first threshold, but this is something else. What was there that? Was no that the first take of that line? No Jesus. Elixir, no potion. Wait. There's an island. He keeps talking about an island. Maybe the macula is behind it. It is we a need... child fantasy. So what's a child's fantasy doing on the wall of your laboratory? Yes. What's out there? Poor girl. You're running away from reality. You must accept your brother's faith and your own. And the fate. He doesn't of blink. The is to do as the order commands. Is he a robot? A damn about your order. I don't know you, I don't work for you! Let me see him! Hugo is tired, Anicia. You can't enter his room in your state. Let. Me. Pass! Not until you've calmed down. You said it yourself. The macula feeds on his emotion. Ah! Kick we the stairs! Kick the stairs! To the Order's quarters in Marseille as soon as possible. I've got a boat and a man, Joseph, waiting at the harbour. He needs to be warned. As for me, I'm going to rest. Let me know when you're ready to go. Lucas. Do you reckon the alchemist is sussy? Yeah. Joseph. Yes, Magistra. Amicia. 
You should come. Be careful. Both of you. Nice. Are you... all right? No. Did you know about Hugo? I... I wanted to tell you, but... You should have. We're talking about my brother, Lucas. I didn't know Magister Vodan would tell you like this. God, I can't... <sighs> Let's just keep going. Problem is, if the Alchemist does turn out to be sussy, which I'm expecting now, but he's been sussy from, like, day blot, it's not like it's a big shock here. Every single encounter with him has been South Central. Lewd. Hear ye! A curfew has been ordered by the Count of All! All townsfolk, stay in your homes! A patrol. Am I missing something? No, he's the Magister, not the Count, right? Or is he the Count? Is the Count the same as the guy, the Magister guy? Or are they different people? Have the beekeeper from the intro been relevant? I mean, they were just random, like, they were just random peeps who were pissed off and then we had to beat them up. The count's different. Oh, okay. What's going on? The city's under lockdown. Anyone caught in the street will be arrested. There we are. They're locking down the whole city. I remember the locked district. They wouldn't dare purge a whole city, would they? I don't know. We need that boat quickly. It's kind of funny in a way that I'm guessing they did not tell their mother, or her mother, about, you know, the 30 people we had to kill. And the tons of people in the district, they're dead. There's a narrative, like, disconnect here somewhere. I'm not quite sure why why the, that information was withheld. I mean, I know she doesn't seem to like her mother very much, but that seems like reasonably pertinent information. Oh, that's some disgustingly nice light. Oh, look at that. Oh, that was nice. Oh, that was a cool effect. Look. Watchtower at the back. It leads to the harbour. Get ready, men. We'll move our load to the docks soon. The docks? That's where we're going, isn't it? Those cages on their guard, I think. Their bodies from the arena. So this is where they take them. Spooky. Yes, we do. No more killing soldiers. Don't worry. I heard you th this still doesn't make any fucking sense. A am I missing something? Why are we so insistent on not defending ourselves? What's the problem? We went through the first game killing fucking tons of people with him in tow, no less. But now, when the people who are trying to kill us, we're not supposed to defend ourselves. What? What? What's the? What's the logic from Lucas here? <laughs> He's a pacifist, I like. I guess, even though he said like, "What's done is done." When the guy got eaten, hello everyone. We're complaining about this because it doesn't make any fucking sense. Welcome in. Thank you for the raid. You playing Poppy's Plato? Christ, what was that like? We're here, right. Silence, Peacock. I hope you can't hear him. He's loud. Be quiet. She's trying to prevent me at least you're being beating another 20 guys. Probably. Lucas is mainly concerned about the connection between Amicia and Hugo. The more murder she gets, the more Hugo finds it okay and starts getting more rat pilled. <laughs> rat pilled is fucking hilarious. Yeah, I guess it could be. I actually, I actually still think it's funnier when she goes on like a slaughter rampage, though. I want her to get like, I want her to get like, um, Red Dead Redemption, like, like, like slow mo, like Lewd. rock braining powers, you know, or something. <laughs> based and rat pilled. <laughs> Is he based? The fresco in his lodge. Is Hugo actually based? He said it's just a symbol. 
A two peak symbol, just as in Hugo's dream. I know. The island, the macula waking up, the order. It's based on rat. Glad to hear you say it. It helps me not to feel alone in this. You're My not. sling has been denied. I'm not allowed to sling anymore. It's also weird, the game did a thing recently, and it hasn't done it for a while now, where it said, depending on the way you play, depends on what upgrades you get. We just went for a section and tried to murder shit, like, every single dude, as best we could. And there's nothing. So there was no upgrade. I don't know what causes the upgrades to happen and when. I guess it's completely story-based. And so, like, it happens at certain points. I wonder if there's like different endings. So if you brain everybody, you can, Hugo. like Hugo gets more rap pilled. He's not dead yet. All right. Remember, no more killing soldiers, no more killing us. I got it. No kills, no being spotted. Let's get this boat. Can I just wind him up and immediately try and kill someone? Nope. The game's decided otherwise. I think. We're here. So where's our boat? Red and white sail. Right there. It's still there. Good. I hope our pilot is too. Good point. Distressing lack of ability to brain people. <laughs> no killing you to get you killed. Yeah, the, it doesn't make it, These people are out to kill us. I get it if we get, you know, we're trying not, to, like, it'd be made more sense if we, like, try not to get caught, like, you know. But he's just like, no one killed anybody. Should be at the gates already. There they are. Keep moving. Quiet. Get off my back. We can't afford to break these jars. The city's running out of time. The game's, the e the game's even decided that I'm not allowed to play that way anymore. Rip. To settle down. Enough arguing, soldiers. Move. Move. What are they doing? Getting in more trouble, I'd say. We should just leave this place. I heard it left nothing but mass graves when it happened in Guyenne. Yes, and soon you will take your place in one. This lockdown is going to get them all. Yeah, Spider-Man's a nerd, yes. though. It's going to be terrible. A real rat carnival. Wait, are we not allowed to let the rats kill people either? Is that also against our creed? Assassin's Creed, I like it. The means I have to think of a one line back to, every, to like everything everyone says around her. I like to think so. I'm assuming if we get caught, then it's instant game over, I rather than let us do anything. Used to be a commercial door to the Mediterranean Sea. Now it will be a door for the spread of the bite. That's depressing. <laughs> it gets kind of juvenile. I mean, she is like 14, you know. <laughs> Lewd. Hey, thank you very much, Mio. Thank you, Gondo. Look, real silk. It probably came from China. I've never seen so much. There's a fortune here. Someone made this on the other side of the world. Do you think it's the same in China? What for the rats? Do you think they have <laughs> the rats too? Maybe not. Not yet. We have to stop this. Fucking love rats. Uh, have we gone the right way here? Oh, is this just a, an extra? No, this doesn't look like the way we need to go. Maybe we're just being dense. HP love rats. Ratties. 
No, this is not the right way to go. What killed the dinosaurs? The Rat Age! Maybe I have to go back this way. No. I'm sorry, I must be being incredibly stupid. I'm clearly missing... something. Oh, we probably climb up there instead? Like, above there? Nope. Nope. There's so much more of the game left. Oh, I know, Maz, I'm not doing it anymore. <laughs> I wanted to do another stream to see if I changed my mind how I felt about it, but I, I don't think I have. Is there a staircase on the balcony? I'm being incredibly stupid, I'm so sorry. There was clearly somewhere we're supposed to go and I can't see. I need some yellow paint on the floor below. Towards the dot. Oh, was there? I'm sorry. Where we came from, right? So I jump over here. No. Nah, I think I'm already kind of. The, the problem is, Maz. Straight through the hole in the wall, there was a hatch leading down. Oh, thank you, Ragno. Like I said, I was, I'm sorry, I was just being dumb dumb. Like here? Behind me. Oh, Jesus. Sorry. Thank you. What dum dum. I think the problem is, Maz, like, I'm already finding things to pick holes at, and, like, that'll end up with streams that'll just not be very enjoyable in the long run. Even if it's a game that I would, like, Let's see that gate. be interested to see where the story takes it, I think I'm too... I'm already too snippy at it, and I think you'd end up with streams where I'm just getting overly snippy, and I don't think that would be that fun. I've, I feel I've gotten pretty good at, like, um... Oh, I can use my sling again now. I think I'm getting pretty good at, like, sort of realising when, um... I'm not enjoying something in the same way. These guys all have helmets anyway. Rip. Soldiers, helmeted. We'll have to sneak around. Hopefully, there's a side way to pass that gate. What do you think is behind it? You end up finishing yours by not trying to be creative and doing what the game wanted. Yeah, you. I mean, you could. You could just play exactly as the game wanted to. Nothing. I just know bodies keep coming from the city, and we had too many of our own. I should have gone to see my mother when I could. Pray. It's all we have left. And that's not much. So we ping this rock here, makes him go over there. And then we get a bit closer. What's, <gasps> What's making that noise? Meow. Meow. Through here. Oh my god, Lucas can actually hold shit. Wow. You wanted to see where it went, but it was unenjoyable and uninteresting to play. That's kind of the problem. When you start getting a bit like this, I just, I find when I'm getting a bit disinterested in a way, like with something, I, I'm not, I get not as invested. And at that point, it gets to, it gets more of a chore. And then that, I think that really bleeds through. I had a few Let's Plays happen like that, where instead of just calling it quits, where I should have done, right? And I, and I sort of just went, I should have just gone like, eh, this is a bit bad and I should stop. What I did was try to power through and end up being really crap. Um, I'll be, I'll be a sec, right? Wait a sec. Eep.
You'd like an example of such a game, or an LP? What, of where I was getting a bit annoyed, or... You mean? There's, there's a few, I'd say. Maiden of Blackwater, Metro Exodus, um, Secret of Mana 2, when I was playing that as well. Eh. Cry of Fear, as much as I love to ha like hate on Hammer Up, Cry of Fear was, like, funny bad. Which meant I could work with it. Um, Metro Exodus was the big one. Last of Us was because I played it already. Yeah, La Last of Us, I, 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 to be fair, I stopped that. I identified it very quickly. Uh, I feel the Evil Within Let's Play was actually okay because I hadn't, um, I hadn't done it. X Blade, uh, I never, I never um, Let's Played X Blade, mind you. I remember, I, th I swear, I have on the Xbox somewhere. I, I swear, I got it on three hundred and sixty or something like that. Thing is, I always say this right. Thing is, you can work with funny bad. Even even like bad bad. You can work with that. If the game is really bad, you can do something with it. The problem is when the game is mediocre. That's when you have a bit of a problem. Or is providing a mediocre experience. Like which means you can't do much commentary on it potentially. You can't do other stuff with it. You you get a bit stuck. And it makes makes it a bit tricky, I think. Mediocre. Plague Tale is generally just slow because you try and be creative and have fun. It's funny, Plague Tale, especially this one so far, feels like there should be more things you could do. Like, imagine if you could set traps for the enemies. Uh, maybe you can later, to be fair. Maybe you can later, you know, uh, but at least at the moment. It'd be nice if you could, like, set traps or do things, but the game definitely feels like it's a certain... It wants you to do certain things a certain way. You saw a YouTube video about obscure RPGs and why they're obscure, and that's where a reincarnation of X-Play came up. Yeah, that Blades of Time one. That's funny, isn't it? I remember x had the sort of anime one, but... No One Lives Forever is really good, yeah. It is very good. I don't know, but... Let's follow that god. And keep our eyes open. Uh... No... Doesn't seem to be any rat bits yet, but... Oh, come on. I think... I know what happened. Drakensang. I remember Drakensang. Never played it, but I remember it. I always remember it, like, um, confusing with Dragon Guard for a long time. They're coming. Ratties. Rats, 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 Have rats. On the ground. It's from their jaws. It smells like tar. If it is, it, it's highly flammable. Try setting it on fire. Yes, yes, let's try. The tar can be ignited by Frank Ignifer. Where's the tar in particular? All around us. Didn't expect that. Neither did they. Lol. Toasty roasty ratties. Two kids who've literally seen rat tornadoes. This is impossible. Yeah, they seem to forget how the rats do shit. Roasty, toasty ratties. Roasty, toasty ratties. It can be pushed. Yes. This is all wrong. Let's hope Marseille is different. Wait until the rats invade it. Amicia, the Order will have special buildings in Marseille. And equipment. And people. People like Voda? How do you think this will end? <sighs> The current one's registering double clicks. Oh yeah, that'd drive you nuts in that, yeah. Just let me know how you get on with that.
I don't have a NIF. Have I missed a NIF somewhere? Is there is there a NIF power up that we've missed? We can't we can't get to the NIF drawer. It's a bit sad. Shit. Or did I stab somebody? I don't think I stabbed anybody. I, I think I've been banned for murder, haven't I? So. If the NIF is nearby, we should have a look for it. I say that like I'm going to continue playing it, but you know, let's pretend I am. Let's look for NIF. Yeah. Right, there's some goodies here. It's very far back. Shit. I'm scammed. If I'm being disingenuous, it's because Last of Us did it. Like that. Do they have a niff on them? Yeah, Deacon say John's knife is fucking hard as fuck. <laughs> like, you know. Whereas all these knives are crap pig metal or something. It's a very decent Tenium knife. Days Gone is a really solid game. Squeak, 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 squeak. Is. Oh, I think I was supposed to get the fishy here. But they can't get the fishy. So if we go back here and then hope we don't get brain by doing this. Delicious fish. Let's try through here. You want to stay with the rock? Makes your head spin. I don't hear any rats. No. But they were here. Look with bunnies, this. they don't harm anybody. Bunnies. What about this door over here? Do we care about this door? It's in this door. Locked from the inside. Oh, this door's locked. Follow the rat snake. Oh, Colonel, there's a lot of rats. What is all this? A tar workshop. They must use it to seal boat hulls. These mechanisms are still intact. It smells different here. Ladies, noble, take it easy, dude. This is a mixing pool. That barrel up there must be the diluent. We should move on. Deacon was just great. Like, Deacon's actually a good example of a protagonist who talks to themselves, but it's legitimately quite funny. Like, Deacon is just unhinged. <laughs> like, Deacon just, Deacon's just been by himself for far too long, and it's really funny. He just starts getting really weird. <laughs> he starts, like, braining people. <laughs> rats, 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 rats. Don't panic. We have resin. It just needs that diluent up there, and we get tall. A pool of tar. That could be our way to that door in the back. That barrel is pretty high, though. We could find a way to reach it. Let's see. I don't think we need to. Like, jokes aside, it's a wood a barrel. I think you could probably that smash that a hole in it with, like, with a sling like this. I mean, obviously, we can't in this game, but, like, that's what you would do, probably. I'm spotted. So we're making tar now. I know. But it shouldn't take us long. Well, let's get to it. Squelchy, tar. Good. Shall I handle the reservoir part? What do you think? Kid in the boot early, oh yeah. Get fucking scammed. Yes, go up that ladder. I'll move the platform closer. On my way. Barrels are odd, but it doesn't look like the sturdiest of barrel. <gasps> yes. 
Turn it all the way. Leave it to me. Turn it all the way. Love that shit. Good. Hold it until I tell you. All right. It wouldn't even let me do it. I tried to scam him. Did you see? Hang it wouldn't on. work. Oh. Oh. I'm trying to get him to drop into the floor. Come back to the basins. Coming. Ah uh, well. Shame. The diluent. I see. It's alcohol, of course. Are we ready? Yes. Let's make that tar. Pouring. Do you know the quantities? No. I'm improvising. Please, don't kill us. Good. I think you can light it up. <laughs> All right. This is going to be very toxic, Let's I feel. See what but... tars work. Huh, it's working. Yes. They start, they start just tripping balls and go... <laughs> I'm stuck. Wait. I think they experimented with some ingredients here. Yes, that could work. I'll throw them to you. Those beasts are really close. Tia, say when you're ready to catch. Go! You can now craft tar. And alcohol now. Mix them. Tar with sling. Done. Perfect. Here now we go. Draw a pot of tar between those two big basins. Please work. Let's see what our tars work. Does the tar only work in certain places, or does it work anywhere? I wonder. Perfect. Yes. That last pool there is already full of tar. Coming. Or in tarnation. I love all the ratty veins and stuff. I think the rats themselves are really neat. <sighs> you saved my skin. The tar did. This stuff works miracles. Anyway. Is tar supposed to be green? I have no genuinely no idea. I, I thought tar was like black, but maybe I'm uh, a yeah, Resin. You feel you give this game one more stream? You reckon? Rat's the real protagonist of the game. Rats are our friends. We should be friends to the rats. There's an image of Batman getting ready to fuck up a barrel. That's pretty funny. Don't be too sure about that. Listen, Amicia. About Hugo. I was stuck between Magister Vaudan and your mother and... Disgusting! Is this even legal? I have no excuse. I was wrong. It's just... I wasn't prepared. I can't lose him. <laughs> I can't. We'll do what's right. We will. I kind of want to see the story, that's the problem, but I'm not sure I want to play it to, find, to re get the story. Through here. Uh. Like, I'm not hate-hating the story. I think it's messy, sure, but it's not like- I don't think it's like dreadful, dreadful. It's just disconnected a bit. Rats got bored. This looks like a suspiciously open area. Look, over there. Joseph's ship. We're quite close. Yes, let's go. Oh, they're here. It's infested down there. Wait, look. Lucas, that's a job for you. Fine. It's a job for you, Lucas, you little shit. Can I make the resin? 
Hi, Hanny Terry. Bra. Just end me now. I liked Rap Hope. He was a shitter. Look, over there. Joe's the ship. We're quite close. Yes, let's go. Oh, they're here. It's infested down there. Wait, look. There's resin down there. And a barrel of diluent over there. They were making more tar here. Let's use it to open a way to our boat then. Yes. Back to making tar. What a day. Is this not cannon? I'm not sure I've helped the situation here. Oh. We need the real tar. I guess I guess my fraud tar isn't correct. This is Asda Tar. Nah, this is fucking little. Little Tar. Alright, let's see what you do. It controls the footbridge. We need that thing here. So, where. How do we get across here then? We want to get up there. Their bakery section is great, to be fair. Take care of it, Lucas. Straight away. That moves it that way. So how do we actually get up there? Who are you? We we're just crossing. What do you want? I've been stuck here for ages with those rats. I need to get out of here. We have a plan. Do you have access to that footbridge? Yes, but I'll need your help. They raised the bridge. I can handle that. This man's our friend. We will not hurt him. We've been instructed not to. Oh shit! Oh. Oh shit! Wait. Yay! Hey! For us, then. There's your diluent. Thank you. He doesn't seem to know about our escape. Oh, he just hasn't figured it out. All right, let go. Immediately. And here we go again. Hey, Into the slot pool. Right? Yes. How does he know I need that? It's fine, he just guessed. Did one plink of his head and he didn't flinch? No, he didn't plink. Because the game didn't expect me to do that. Just wait. Yeah, the game didn't expect me to throw anything, so he didn't actually make a reaction for him. Right. That's something. Hey, what's that flaming thing you threw in there? That's uh it's homemade. Basic alchemy. Alchemy? We don't much like all that around here. Too bad, because it's gonna save your skin. Oh. Don't like them there, alchemists. Good. Now there are two other basins ahead. Let's get to it then. 
Amicia, you should get on that footbridge to manage the diluent. Bing! Bong! Alright, I'll tell you when I need you. Boing! Ironically, David Cage can have more options of a diversion gameplay. What a horrifying thought. Hey, Al, thanks for the raid, dude. How was your star oceaning? to do it a little bit. That's enough. Let go. Immediately. Oh, I see. Great. It's in position. Yeah. One solution, many options that don't work. Yeah. yeah. Time to like this one too. Am I being silly? Is it why did my tar solution didn't didn't work? Is it because there was already dilution in there? So that when I threw my tar thing in there it didn't work. Is that why we gotta do it this way? There you go. There's still a boat blocking the way. This one's yours to lift. Oh, the way it does is so annoying. Right. Lucas, that's a job for you. Agreed. That's a job for you, Lucas. There's not enough isn't water in the pits, yeah? Makes sense. Good teamwork. You're surprisingly efficient for civilians. We've had to rely on ourselves a lot. We're almost there. Just fill up that last basin. Oh no, did I need to... Why are we lighting these to upset the rats? I'm done. Light it over, rats ill like fire, Risen. Lucas, you can come. The way's clear. All right. I wouldn't say the way's clear per se, but you know. How's he gonna get across? Amicia, I'm blocked! No, the light doesn't reach far enough! There should be a way! Yes, just throw tar directly into the fire! It will boost the flames for a while! That's... Well, yes, that will work! Alright, let's try! This man thinks he's a fucking alchemist now, does he? <laughs> My yeah, eyes! Perfectly. Thank you. That was actually pretty smart. We may not know alchemy, but we've dealt with our fair share of tar. All right. We saw the jars. What are you doing with it? That's confidential. Huh? Right. You're almost there. Oh, I've got to lift. If I got to lift this one. Very clever. Hey, can you use your thing again? I'm stuck here. I'll try. Yes. <laughs> you should leave him there. That'd be so funny. Bye, nerd. Alright. Time to meet him face to face. We'll be careful. Who knows what he'd have done if we'd met in the city? Follow orders. Yes. No matter what they were. That was good work. We did it. I'm lucky you decided to break the law tonight. We should go now, no? Yes, we're in a hurry. Sure, 
I'll escort you back home. Actually, we must keep going that way. Impossible. You're going back home. Well, come on. Let us go. We did our part. The law is the law. Let us pass, or you'll regret it. You're threatening a soldier of the army of Provence? I am. This is too important. Wait. Wait. In the outskirts, our men got attacked by a girl and a boy. You! You escaped! Amicia, you could be here with the team. Come on, the boat is right there. Yes. Oh, I could have blinded him. Wait, so what happened if you don't blind her? I'm curious, like, let me just, uh... I'm just curious, like, what happens if we use the tar to blind him? What, what difference does it play off? Do you reckon we'll get something different? Time to meet him face to face. We'll be careful. Who knows what he'd have done if we'd met in the city. Follow the orders. Yes, no matter what they were. Oh, it's good work! We did it! Oh, lucky you decided to break the law tonight! We should go now, no? Yes, we're in a hurry. Sure, I'll escort you back home. Actually, we must keep going that way. Squidgy tar in a string. Oh, come on. Let us go. We did our part. The law is the law. The Let law. Pass, or you'll regret it. You're threatening a soldier of the army of Provence? I am. This is too important. Wait. Wait. In the men got attacked by a girl and a boy. The you, law. You escaped. Amicia, you could be out. Ah! 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 We don't have time for this. Run to the stairs. Come on. The boat is right there. Oh my god, it actually changes. I got an achievement for it. Something different happened. I'm done trusting any of them. Yes. Holy shit. All right, let's get to work. I don't have enough matte aerials for the double. An additional jar. Jars are very exciting. Additional alchemical. I don't want that. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save for more swag. I want to be able to brain Let's extra people. Boat. It's a public health matter. You should have left when you still could, Joseph. I am waiting for a client, and I always honor my contracts, my friend. Consider your contract cancelled, then. The harbor's locked down, and you're trespassing. He's our man. Yes, and trouble's coming. We need to move. All right, you know what? I have better places to be. No, you've seen too much. I'm arresting you. Oh, come on. You know what? Piss off! Yeah, fuck him up. We need to leave town. That guard is just standing there. He's frozen underneath the docks. Do you see him? What's he doing down there? He's stuck here. There's a child with us. All right, all right. Meet me at the next pontoon. There's just a man underneath the docks, just chilling. Oh, he's allowed to kill people. I don't know. Too dangerous. We'll get killed or miss that boat. I need to use my sling again. Yes. Do what you must. We need that boat at all costs. <laughs> Fuck off, you little dickhead. Alright. We'll continue this section next. I just realised it's uh, getting late. Uh, we need to use my sling again. Shut up. <laughs> Not necessarily. I love the guy who's just chilling out underneath. That's quite funny. Oh dear. Yeah, that's uh. Got another 10 minutes of food, then you scold. I'll, uh, I'll raid you now then.
There we go. So Rufo will be streaming shortly if anyone wants to stick around and wait. He's doing some scold, but he will be about 10 minutes. So go make a cup of tea and then come back. Have a bit of a nice chill. Then look at some scold. Thanks very much for watching, everyone. I don't know if I'll stream tomorrow. I'll let you know. If I do, it'll be something very easy to stop if I need to, you know. So uh, wish me luck. Hope it all goes all right. And, uh, you know, all the rest of it. Cat, cat, cat. Right. Cheers, everyone. I'll let you know how it goes. See you tomorrow. Bye.